The motivation of our work is to learn robust policies with minimal supervision. On one hand, we can provide a set of real-world demonstrations and do imitation learning on these. However, we need large amounts of human effort to learn robust policies in this manner. On the other side, we can do RLN simulation. However, this also comes with its downsides. We need expert effort to create the scenes and to do reward engineering. What we propose is to construct simulations on the fly to improve the robustness of imitation learning. We propose Rialto. Here is a sneak peek of the different tasks that we solve with Rialto. The policies show a high level of robustness to different object poses, distractors, and disturbances. Rialto brings a 67% improvement over standard imitation learning. Rialto consists in constructing a simulated twin of the real scene so that we can fine-tune a policy using RL in simulation without having to collect any more real-world data. And finally, transfer this policy back to the real world. Let me walk you through Rialto's pipeline. We start scanning our environment and bringing it into a simulation. Rialto is compatible with any 3D reconstruction technique that returns a mesh. Thereafter, we use multiple techniques depending on the object or the scene we're trying to scan, and we give more details and recommendations on which techniques to use in the paper. The next step consists in using Rialto's graphical unit interface to finish the setup of the scene. Mainly, we let the user segment the meshes and add the articulations. All this can be done within 4 minutes. The next step of Rialto consists in bringing a few real-world demonstrations into the simulation. We do so with an inverse distillation procedure, where we first train a vision-based policy from real-world demonstrations, and second, we roll out this policy trained from real-world demos in simulation to collect a set of privileged demonstrations. Next, we can do our L fine tuning and simulation, starting from those demonstrations that we just collected with our vision-based policy, and then we also use a sparse reward. As we see, using demonstrations is very important, since otherwise the policy will learn to exploit the model's inaccuracies to succeed. Hence, the demonstrations bias the policy towards a real-world transferable policy. The final step consists in transferring the state-based policy trained in simulation to one that takes point clouds obtained from a depth camera as the input. We do teacher-student distillation with the addition of code training on the previously collected real-world demonstrations, which as we show with more details in the paper, narrows the sim to real gap. Finally, we compare Rialto to standard imitation learning, and we show you how Rialto increases the robustness of imitation learning to different object poses, distractors, and disturbances drastically.